Maria Virginova may not be a household name yet, but she has a face that could soon be recognised globally. She's the first Russian to have gained a Ladies European Tour card, and she's also a pioneer to anyone coming to the sport of golf late. This 25-year-old never knew the sport existed until she was 12, in a story that is quickly becoming the stuff of golfing legend. It's, it's a very common question because everyone asks me. We just, me and my dad, we went through the golf club in Czech Republic and stopped for a cup of coffee. And I had nothing to do that summer, so you know, I was keep popping back to the golf club and hitting a few balls and then I had a lesson and that's how it started. It was like a little hobby and it was something that I was doing in my summer holidays and you know, I never thought that it would turn out to more something bigger than this. I never knew there was such a thing as professional golf and you know, uh, when I made my card, I was over the moon and hopefully I can make myself, you know, play an LPJ. While America is the long-term goal, the Russian is currently spanning Europe. A fifth and eighth place finish her best results in four years on the tour. At the moment, I base myself in Germany, in Munich, so I've been living there for a whole year and, you know, I'm still thinking moving somewhere else, maybe to a warmer country and where I can practice all the time because my winter, like pre-season, was quite bad and I was hitting balls in like minus five weather. You know, it's not good, I guess, for golf. I was one of the best golfers like three, four years ago in Russia and uh, since I turned pro, this kind of came down a little bit because uh, I live kind of in my own world. <laughs> and it's her glamour girl looks that set her apart too, with plenty of comparisons made between Virchinova and Russian tennis starlet Anna Kornikova. Uh, usually they go for Sharapo. <laughs> uh, you know, I don't mind. I mean, uh, these girls are, you know, they achieved a lot of things and uh, uh, hopefully, you know, in a few years people will say Maria, uh, Maria Virginov is a good golfer instead of, you know, saying uh, Maria Sharapova. <laughs> Tennis is so big in Russia and, uh, you know, it's always been pushed by president and golf just started it and it's a very young sport, so in a few years hopefully we'll see more players. You know, I think we need kind of a push, probably uh, maybe from me and, you know, to kind of um, push the kids going forward and wanted to play golf. While Maria Virchinova has done great things already for golf in Russia, there's the potential for her to raise the profile of the sport globally if she can crack the LPGA Tour. For now, I'm just thinking, you know, playing this season very good and have no injuries like I had last year and, you know, just hopefully get through the LPGA qualifying school and play in America.